this is a Blender add-on um, and just as a quick refresher, to install a Blender add-on you go to Edit Preferences and then there's a tab called Add-ons. Click Install. When you download the package it'll be a zip file. You want to unzip this main package and inside there there's a Blender AE.zip file which we don't unzip. You select that zip file and click Install Add-on. And as you can see, um, now it automatically pops up here, but we also need to enable the add-on by checking this checkbox. And we can check if Blender's in, Blender AE is installed by going into the viewport, pressing N, and it will be one of the tabs on the side here. And we can see it's installed and we can disable and enable that add-on. Great. So there's a couple of ways to connect to After Effects. At the moment I don't have After Effects open, so if I click Connect to AE, it'll pop up and say it's not, it hasn't detected an After Effects instance. So the easiest way to connect is to make sure After Effects is open first. I'll open it now. And when After Effects is open, now if we jump back to Blender and click Connect to AE, it'll search for the program and automatically fill this out and connect. Another way of connecting is by clicking the folder icon and we can navigate to the Adobe After Effects program file. Which on Windows is called After Effects.exe and click accept. And that'll also fill up fill out the path or you can copy and paste the path. There is one more option you can try if these other methods aren't working for some reason. Inside the package folder, if you unzip the Blender E.zip file, inside here you'll see there's a Blender AE, AE shutdown and startup um, script file. You can actually add these to the startup and shutdown folders in the After Effects script folders in our After Effects support files, scripts, there's a startup and shutdown folder. So you can copy these into these folders. Now when After Effects starts up, it'll actually create a small file that Blender AE will be able to locate and add the path to the After Effects program quickly and connect as you can see so thank you for all the feedback and all the support i hope you find this tool useful in your workflow